on Gladius to any unit in transmission range. Station Arc, 9-5. Our unit has sustained casualties, and we're running low on supplies. We're requesting support or evac from our position at Cambridge Police Station. We appreciate the assistance, civilian, but what's your business here? I'm just trying to survive out here, like everyone else. The way you charged in and engaged those ferals, I find that a bit difficult to believe. Are you from a local settlement? Sure. Do all these questions really matter? After all, I helped you fight... You make a fair point. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been different. Uh -huh. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. That all depends. How much you... So you're a mercenary. Typical. Fine. You help us, and I'll see you're compensated for your... Right. I'm Paladin Dance. Brother. Over there is Scribe Halen. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man. I've been trying to send a distress call to me. Sir, if I may. Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need, the deep-range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the brother? No time to waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. Halen, take Reese inside and find his wounds. Yes, sir. Reese, once you're on your feet, I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure. I'm on it. All right, civilian. It's time to prove your worth. Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out, people. All right, big guy. Paladin Dance. Let's go. You ready yeah, to move yeah, out? I'm coming. Ready. Outstanding. Follow me and try not to lag behind.
Paladin. Keep moving. Double time it. It might surprise you to learn that my recon team isn't the first to visit the Commonwealth. Over the last seven years, two other teams were sent here by the Brotherhood to gather technology. The first team's mission was a huge success. They came back with crates full of pre-war artifacts and historical documents. The second wasn't so fortunate. Shortly after they arrived, we lost contact with them, and they haven't been heard from since. As far as my team goes, we've lost four good men to this godforsaken wasteland. We've been a target from the moment we arrived. But despite our setbacks, I don't intend to give up and head home, or end up missing. Shouldn't be any exterior. Paladin dance. Pick up the pace. Time's wasting.
Excuse me, Paladin Dance. Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security's already been dealt with. Good. Less security. Negative. Look at the... Mm -hmm. These robots were assaulted by Institute Synth. I'll be on the lookout. Roger that. Uh -huh. This place is a mess, but I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be interested in. After we're done here, I'll have to mark this place for sweet and retrieve. Look, looks like a dead end. See if you can find a way to get that door open. Watch your footing. Looks like the power's out in this section. Engine core power restored. Thermal engine fuel. Prime command accepted. Commencing five second countdown. Five. Four.
efficiency rating of 96.7%. Remain vigilant. 
dance. Well, that could have gone smoother. Smoother? I thought we did fine. That sweep was sloppy. We were caught unprepared more than once, which is unacceptable. However, your extra gun gave us the edge we needed. I'm not certain I could have accomplished the mission alone. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian who can follow orders properly. Uh -huh. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I think you'll... Mm -hmm. May it serve you well in battle. That isn't necessary. I insist you keep it. The bro sure. Now, we had a lot. Uh -huh. Our op could have ended, and uh -huh. there's no the way right. I, you could. Mm -hmm. Or, uh -huh. I'd be honored to join. That's what I wanted to hear. Meet me back at the police station. Dance. Report back to the police station. I'll be there soon. And dance. Glad to see you alive and well, sir. Are we in luck, sir? Mission accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally! Some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone.
Aelin, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. She shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think she has the potential of becoming one of the best.
Good. Paladin. Good. You're back. Aelin? Uh -huh. She shows a lot of promise. Thanks. I promise not to let you. You don't have to prove anything else to me. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you... Let's just hug this out and get it over with, huh? What do you say? You can play it however you want, tough girl. It's gonna take a lot more than completing one mission to impress me. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of it. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we, if you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets. Uh-huh. That won't be a problem. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a long lecture. So I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignments, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of Initiate. This is only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Thank you. Thanks aren't necessary. Ad Victorium. She doesn't even know what that... Ad Victorium. In our eye. Our rallying... Uh -huh. Now. Godsworth? As I live and breathe! Oh, it's... Sure. Godsworth. What? A... He's... Oh, uh, it's... Sean's been kidnapped. It... Doesn't matter how long it's been. That... What? Food? Right. 
Hey, Codsworth. Mom, don't worry. My search protocols are on full alert. Sensors are picking up movement in another house. Follow me! nearby and well thanks for your help codsworth good luck i shall remain codsworth there must be someone who can help you in confidence Now, now. It's okay. Now, now. It's okay.
open the gate. <sighs> Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Boom. I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> Damn it, Danny, open up! You. You want into Diamond? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? You hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Sounds good. Let's go. Who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Head on inside. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the... Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument. Welcome to the great green jewel of the common... Don't let this muckraker here tell you up. This hasn't been the friendliest welcome. She's got you there, McDonough. Guess not everyone gets won over by that shark smile of yours. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came... I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? That's my business. Well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Hmm, <laughs> a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. You gotta wonder. Does anyone fight back? It's the two has to have energy, right? What? You told you your luck wouldn't last forever. His ties. Oh, Nick. The bill. Something wrong? 
Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and... Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> 